was it actually Conor McGregor that inspired you to look for those money making opportunities or was it just the fact you're out of the cage for so long and you need to make up the money that you missed oh no 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 financially I'm doing alright man you know not to sound like that but I'm doing alright um it just you know kind of really introduce uh, you know what what talking can do and what asking can do you know what I mean and oftentimes I don't think the fighters realize that without the fighters it's not much of an organization and uh, I just feel like if you feel like you know your worth and if someone wants to have you step outside of your comfort zone to do something, they should make it comfortable for you. You know, they should make it worth your while. Do you have a figure in mind? That a you, figure in mind? Yeah, that but the nice? UFC... No, I don't want to show my hand. I don't want to show my hand. You know, I'm sure the UFC would be like, he said, what? <laughs> for this fight? Um, but, I, you know, it, it would have to make some, some sense. You know, the UFC, well, we just got brought for what, $4 billion? 4.2. 4 4.2. So the money's there. You know, just take care of some of us guys. Well, what do you, I've been loyal for a long time. Well, what do you think the interest is in a third fight? Like, like if you're asking for a certain amount, it's because you think the fight is worth something, right? Yeah, what what do you think the, why do you think that fight is so, is so valuable? Well, the reason why, you know, why I think it, it would cost more for me is because Daniel Cormier is considered by most people, by some people, I should say, it's the greatest of all time. And to fight the greatest of all time while he's weighing 30 pounds bigger, more than you, is it's dangerous no matter who you are and so um so i would want to make it worth my while because ultimately 